If you are joining us here for the first time, my name is Shane Farmer, this is Dark Horse Rowing, and we are all about fitness, bringing you guys the rowing machine, helping explain how this thing works, but also talking about broader concepts as health and fitness. So if this is your first time here, guys, make sure that you like, subscribe, and share. God, I hope you like this, because this is, this is a doozy. Let's go have some fun. What's up, guys? Today, we are at Kuaipe Mountain here in San Diego, California, and we're going to take a rower to the top of that mountain. Why? Because we can, and because it's gonna be awesome. There is no reason that we can't just get outside, be fit, do things with our bodies. There is an awesome opportunity to mess around with fitness and to have fun with it. So, let's get up the mountain. Now, typically, we consider these things pretty light and mobile because we can break them into two pieces and I can move it around pretty easily. However, I feel like that's probably gonna change like 200 feet up this trail. So, we are here at the base of Kuaipei. We're gonna carry this erg to the top. I wanna say it's about 2,000-ish feet of elevation gain. Normally, I can run this in about 19 minutes. I'm guessing this is gonna take us, I don't know, near an hour, maybe? A Concept 2 Model D, out of the box, weighs 57 pounds, plus my bag, which is a nimble four pounds compared to the erg. Um, we're taking like 60 pounds up the mountain and then we're gonna do a workout at the top, all in an effort to get you guys excited about going and doing fitness. My goal is to maintain a bit of a jogging pace. We'll see how that goes. The jog pace, not as bad as I thought. It's just grindy so far, surviving. Okay, we're there. Yeah. So, this is the infamous Kuaipei Falls Peak. We're through about half of the elevation gain, but distance wise, we've covered three quarters of the mountain. So, in the last quarter, we got half of the elevation gain. We will see how that goes, but look at this. This is why we fitness. Because nobody else gets this view, except for those of you that earn it. This is what's worth it, is to be the ones up here. We made it. Here we are, top of Kuaipei Mountain. I think that probably took about 29 minutes. Not as slow as I would have thought. Listen, the whole point of this is simply to show you that fitness is everywhere. It doesn't belong just to a machine. It doesn't belong just outside. You can make fitness whatever you want it to be. So we're gonna work out up here, but really get outside. Go If you love the rower, go use the rower. If you, love, if you found us because of this rower, stick with us. We're gonna show you even more cool stuff with this thing. And we're gonna take this all sorts of places. And this mountain is just the first. So we just climbed uh, Kuaipei Summit here in San Diego. Got a workout in at the top. We hiked it back down. The hike down was so much worse. Can you see my shoulders? <laughs> I was worth it though. So guys, this has been Rowing in Inappropriate Places with me, Shane Farmer, and Dark Horse Rowing. Make sure that you guys like, subscribe, share. If you enjoyed this video, we'll bring you more. We'll take this thing to even weirder places and more inappropriate places do more inappropriate rowing for you. Uh, but in the meantime, have a great one, guys. We'll see you on the other side. Did someone <laughs> swipe? Oh, you gotta say something about that. So, at the beginning of, of the climb, we put up uh, Ben's GoPro. He's on the other side of the camera right now. And set it up inside a bush to kind of time lapse the whole day. Somebody stole it. Guys, don't take other people's stuff. Do, do have your own things. You don't need to take somebody else's. Because doing that is just being a real turd. Maybe the person was being nice. And maybe we'll find it on Craigslist, Lost and Found. Hopefully. But seriously, don't take people's stuff. Come on. This is a public service announcement. Shane Farmer, Dark Horse Rowing. <laughs> don't take people's shit.